Are you too honest to pass a lie detector test? If you feel guilty just thinking about doing something wrong, you might fail your polygraph. If that sounds like you, it's useful to consider how the test works before you take one. I'm Todd Reichardt, and this is Clearance Jobs TV. In a polygraph examination, three to six sensors are attached to the examinee's body in order to measure his or her breathing rate, pulse, perspiration, and blood pressure. At the start of the exam, diagnostic questions determine the examinee's baseline physical responses. So, at the start, the examinee is asked to lie. This establishes that baseline. You can imagine what the rest of the test looks like if you've ever watched a cop show. The polygraph isn't actually detecting lies. There are no sensors attached to your brain. The American Psychological Association has more accurately labeled it as a fear detector. That's just one reason why it's not accepted in a court of law. Unlike civilian protections in the courts, a security clearance isn't a right. If you're submitting to a polygraph examination en route to working in the intelligence community, keep that in mind. And don't overthink the test. In a polygraph exam, the old phrase, the only thing we have to fear is fear itself, becomes very relevant.